Speed is involved in about 30% of fatalities, traffic fatalities, so it's an important issue uh, to address. Automated speed cameras on Sacramento City streets could become a reality if state lawmakers have their way. Right now, a pilot program in the Bay Area is being talked about, but critics of the bill worry it could have a negative impact all across the state. CBS 13's Drew Balea is live at the state capitol tonight. He's getting answers on whether cameras would work and why there is a push to get them up and running. Drew? Well, these cameras will be similar to those red light cameras that are already in place in downtown Sacramento, except they'll be looking for speeders. And now there's a push to put a five year pilot program in place to see how effective these cameras would be at slowing people down. It will make, I think, the streets much better and safer. Reactions are mixed. I think it's terrible. About the possibility of speed cameras watching drivers on busy roads. I think it's a. Uh natural habit to go a little faster than maybe we should, especially if we're running late. Speeding is a big issue. Walt Seifert with the Sacramento Bicycle Advisory Committee says reducing speed will save lives. We want to eliminate fatalities and uh, serious injuries. On average, 26 people die on Sacramento City roads each year. Seifert says cameras can deter people from pushing the pedal. It's there to enforce 24 hours a day, seven days a week, something that uh, a police officer can't do. Sacramento already has red light cameras, but they snap a picture of both the license plate and the driver. These proposed speeding tickets wouldn't snap a picture of the driver, leaving whoever the vehicle is registered to on the hook for the ticket. Ticketing alleged speeding vehicles by the tens of thousands is not addressing the cause of these collisions. Tom McGuire with the California Association of Highway Patrolmen spoke out against the bill. A speed camera has no discretion. A speed camera doesn't have the ability to assess a situation. A speed camera doesn't know what the safe speed is. Cameras on some corners. It could be happening in the coming years. Now, there is still some time. This bill won't be discussed until January. And if it does get passed, then those cameras will be put in place in San Jose and San Francisco for five years. But Seifert says that there's still time to encourage Sacramento to also get involved with that pilot program. Well, it certainly is a controversial issue, Drew. There's no question about it, something we will continue to follow. Thanks so much for that live report from the